Hi Richard, my name's Hi. Francis, I'm the cardiology Lady Nurse Consultant. Your GP sent you up to the clinic this morning for to have a, an exercise tolerance test done. You've obviously been complaining of some chest pain, is that right? Yes, um, just kind of mostly in the kind of centre of my chest, some tightness, um, probably for say the last kind of couple of weeks to, to a month, yeah. That tight feeling, does it go anywhere else? Does it go down your arms or up your jaw? No, it just seems to stay across the centre part of my chest. Okay. Does it make you feel breathless or sick or...? No, I, f I feel slightly warmer, maybe a bit sweaty, but I don't, okay. I don't feel breathless or sick. No. And you're not aware of your heart beating fast in your chest or anything like that? No, I don't think so, no. Not at no. all. And you say that you can get it when you're exercising, but you can also get it when you're at rest as well. And the next thing I'm going to do is just bring some cables across because obviously we need to attach up all these so that we can have a look at your initial heart tracing. Here we go, so we just wire you up to this little lot now. Here we go. Have you been on a treadmill before at all? I have, yeah, I've used a treadmill before. At the gym or somewhere like that? Yeah, at the gym. So you've got a rough idea of what we're going to do yep. to you today. The idea is we're going to send you for a walk up a bit of a hill. Okay. The most important thing is you let us know straight away if you start to feel any of that chest discomfort or any problems at all you that you're having. Now obviously Francis and I will be with you the whole time and we'll be monitoring your blood pressure and your heart rate very closely as well as some other things. But please let us know if there's any changes that worry you. Okay, so we're just going to pop this belt around your waist, which okay. will keep everything attached to you during the test. Thanks, that's great. <laughs> Lovely, great. So that's you. We'll get you down from there now and we'll show you what to do and get you on our treadmill. Richard, I'm just going to put this blood pressure cuff on your arm. I will record your blood pressure a few times throughout the test. You will hear the, a bleep in the machine. Don't worry about that. That's just to remind me to take a blood pressure. Your blood pressure will go up through the test and your heart rate will go up through the test. But that's a natural response to exercise and that's what we're looking for. Okay. okay. Just before we get started, I have a last set of instructions for you. When the belt starts moving, what we want you to do is start walking straight away, keeping up to the top half of the treadmill all the time here. Now, once, we get start, once you get comfortable, you're going to go up a small gradient into level one. And that's going to be you for the first few minutes of the test. So I want you to really relax and take your time with that. Importantly, like we were saying earlier, let us know straight away if you feel any of this chest discomfort you've been getting or any other symptoms that's bothering you. All okay. right, you just let us know. No okay, we're going to get started with the test now. So if you can take a long, slow stride right up to the top of the treadmill here for us. That's the way. Good. And now I'm going to put you up the small hill and that's just going to get you into level one, okay? Great stuff, if you can just take your time with that. First three minutes and let us know, as I say, any problems. How are you feeling at that? Yeah, that's fine, no problem. Great. Are you still feeling fine there at the moment? Okay, quite warm, I'm okay, yeah. Good, well we're going to get you into level two, which means slightly faster and slightly okay. steeper. Now it's just going to change over in five seconds, all right? You're okay. going to hear it moving up a gear right now. That's you, up in level two. How are you finding that? That's okay. Great, good. You have no chest pain at the moment, Richard? No, I feel fine, good. Okay, that's your finished level two now. 
So we're going to make it a little bit faster and steeper again, provided okay. you're feeling OK still. Yeah, feel fine, None of that discomfort no, at all. Nothing. OK, it's about to get faster and steeper for you now. It's quite hard work, this one. A bit more of a quicker walk for you. That's you finished the test there, so we're going to just start slowing things down now. You can keep walking straight to the top till it comes to a halt. Okay. Now when it does stop, you might feel a little bit lightheaded and giddy. You don't want you to worry about that, it's quite okay. normal. All right. We're just going to start slowing things down now. now. If you could just keep walking to the top, and we'll bring you to a halt now, okay? Great, that's you, well yep. done. Hi Richard, I've got the result of your, your exercise test and it's looking good. good. Um, you did nine minutes on the test, you had no symptoms while, while you were on the test mm -hmm. and your ECG is actually, your chasing of your ECG is actually looking fine. There's no abnormalities in it that we would be concerned about. Okay. So thinking about your symptoms, you presented with a rather atypical presentation for yep. angina and your treadmill test is, is very good. So what we would be saying is this is certainly not angina. What I'll do now is, is write to your GP, okay. tell them that you have been up to the clinic, you've done your treadmill test and everything looks fine. Okay. How do you feel about that? Quite relieved. Um, it's obviously not related to my, to my heart or angina, so yeah, I'm quite happy. Um, so it was, I'd obviously didn't experience any signs or symptoms when I was on, on the test, so yeah, pretty relieved. Yep. Okay.